recording now. Yeah, I just wanted to point out if anyone has had the had the jab, if we want to revert it, the negative part, anything for you not I go, try and take it away. So don't come back. Marlene, did you have a question? You're on mute. Marlene, unmute yourself. Two questions. <laughs> Hi everyone. Hi. Yeah. Um, I didn't get the jab, not get the jab, but a very good friend of ours um, who's doing excellent work. Did get it. Now, we cannot infringe on people's free will decisions. Um, he may be one who decide to get it to help um, bring forward the agenda in other realms. He is very, very sick at this point. His name is Jim. Uh, you may know of him, Jim Charles. Um, we did a huge healing meditation on him on Thursday night. Um, so it's in God's hands at this point. It's God's will. If he be transitioning or not, I don't know. And truthfully, it's none of my con- it's none of my business to know that. It's between Jim and creator so i was thinking that maybe um should he decide to stay on this realm if we can perhaps um help him in this way and ultimately i've been i've been praying a lot for him and meditating a lot and and, uh speaking with our father creator and um in the in respect that it's his will if jim transitions or stays with us so i'm just putting it out there if we feel that um you know, we, we can lend a hand in this way. Really grateful. Thank you. And we have to um, ask his higher self. This is... Uh... Yes, of course. Yes. Is, it, is it possible we can have an image, Mark? We've got an image on phone. Um, let me try and get it. I know Jim. I, yeah. know, I know Jim. We know yes, Jim. Yes, you do. You do. He is, yeah, he's very, very ill. Uh, the lower part of his lungs, when I did a, a scan on him, yeah. the lower part of the lungs, the uh, we call it the, uh, give me, I, the, the word is not in my consciousness right now um this is where the um, this is where it's going on um he was he decided to get an occupy what he he to get an occupy. yeah so i'm looking for jim um i'm being told that he also chose this as his exit when i heard that he was ill to this at this you point, really unmuted yourself for Molly. i apologize i'm okay. yes yes deb yes um, when I heard news, this is the thing, first thing that prompted, this is his ex's way of transition, part of the team on the other side who will be helping us. Um, as Elijah, um, this is what came to mind, that his mission was just about his chair. Thank you. Yeah, I'm, I'm very surprised because I just saw a video, I think it was a week or two ago of him. And I, it, so this is sudden. Two weeks ago. Actually, he started to be ill uh, 12 days ago today. And uh, now he's really the lowest part of uh, whatever he's going through right, right now. Is he in the hospital? Um, last, spoke, last time I, I spoke to Angie last night, uh, she said that if he wasn't feeling better, she would take the first time that he got diagnosis or help from a doctor was uh, maybe a week ago and it was uh, a virtual consultation whereas now she decided that as of today if better he, she would take him to uh, a one-on-one consultation with doctor so I haven't heard Angie as far as of as of yesterday so yeah it, it can be all of the above it's uh, his choice his decision, his group's whole decision, and creator's decision at this point. Oh, and you haven't got a picture of him. Cause I'm happened? looking for him, sweetheart. Yeah. I'm looking what, for what, him. <laughs> what can happen in these stages? Yeah, it, it, it's telling me I can't even share the screen. Um, I don't know why they're shutting that off on Zoom now. Because I, I remember a 27-year-old, I, I gave Ewing a, a, a cancer, and she died within half an hour. And what I realised, that I gave her a blessing. Uh, she cleared <laughs> all the anything to, to stop him. So it can happen like that. Kind of where, uh, yeah, he's like blessing him on you. Phil, Phil, you know who Jim Charles is. He's uh, the, the channeler for Hukolo. Hello. Yeah. That's right. You know who he is. Okay. Oh, should we send him email then? What is this? Yeah, we are. I'm, uh, Deb, I'm leaking up to you. Is this him? Uh, I actually had a conversation. Tell you what, Deb, I got very, very off. There's always a big back going on. Okay. I lost the, um, since I got, we, we lost our internet for about a minute there. Um, I lost chat. Yeah, I've got it. Uh, okay. Unless someone else is, I've only just come on. Unless it's before I came on. Yeah, the next John and Joe. Shall we give him a card first? Shall Marlene? I pick a card? Shall I pick a card, Marlene, for him? I do, uh, I'll, I'll pick one. I do remember that David was first and then Victoria. Then I don't know after that. Yeah, I, I, I came in after. There you go. That's for divine timing. Probably about right. Prayers are being answered by universal prayers. Did you hear that, Marlene? Apologize for off screen. No, I, I did hear. 
advertise for that. Yeah, I, I picked an oracle card for him and he's got divine time. Prayers are being answered. I did connect. His I prayers did, are being answered. I did connect. Oh, that was his... I did connect spirit and it did let me in. It, it's spirit let me do a bit of work. Yeah, oh. I don't do ISL, so I, I've, I've changed that. It's more, you get true answers. The ISL might. Well, I, I clap. I, I got it. Was okay. Let us know. Okay, so who's the next one? It was David next. Uh, that from that was the first uh, uh, signed in. Oh, actually, I do see it. David wants to know. I do have the screen from the beginning. That's odd. It was like I never left. That's <laughs> <laughs> well, if possible, I'd like to see how things are. I still have issues, but I believe that I'm making progress. Isn't that weird? It came up. David, let's see. David, say something so I see you. And Phil, keep your mouth yeah, shut. Hello. hello. Um, thank you for talking to me. Sure. Um, I've had quite a good week. I've been a lot more positive, and I believe things are getting better. Although, physically, I still have the thyroid issue and the cold. Did we just look? Uh, Debbie, still here? Yeah. Uh, you had a past life problem, didn't you? A lot of trauma brought it down. And that seems yes. to be... That seems to be them. Yes, that's right. Uh, Deb's scanning, yeah. I think I'll give me. Thank you. He's got a spider on him. Oh no! Sort of spider. This is spiritual. Yeah, yeah. It's like a black widow. Oh, quite a few of these going around. <laughs> <laughs> it's it's down by his root his root chakra and now it's crawling around towards the front of him it's trying to hide from me I'm glad I came now it jumped out at me like coming towards me send some uh, dragon play. David what, what's, what pain have you got or what's your problem um, well the most serious one is coldness and brain fog due to a low thyroid you feel any no no spider's going huh? it was a feminine it was a female but it kept trying to intimidate me <laughs> If I may add, the, spi the spiders are belong to another realm of reality. Uh, well, we're used to dealing with them. We've seen them a lot. Do you see the cord? It's still the cord there? I can see it like on the cord. Uh, we cut the cord. No, 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 no. I want you to deal with the cockroach. What cockroach? It's a cockroach as well. I, I, I saw a cockroach now. <sighs> they're not They're not the smell. What's with the insects? This one. This one's changing color. Black to gold. It wants to hide. But it's Marley, not on him. Huh? What, uh, Marley, what were you saying about it from a different dimension? Well, they're AI. We are getting attacked by a lot. That's right. My, my Orion journey last week, Sally from the other healing, I brought back five gooey creeks from Orion and Eli had to clear them. <laughs> <laughs> and I've got I've got a burn mark from it. They actually I, burnt me. I hmm? know. Who who healed you from them? Hmm? Who healed you from them? I've got I've got a, a very good heal at the even sense I go through. I've also got marks on the forehead that it was a bit of a battle when I got I brought them back the damage. Uh, so right. they're coming in from a dip it's getting through the aura field by going through. Why are they coming in for him? No me check three people out. At check this point energy. they want at this point they want to gather as many souls as possible. There's a battle going on between the, the baddies themselves where they're soliciting as many souls as they can to come into their groups. That's probably since the uh, problem with the, the, the problem with uh, the Queen of Orion. They've probably separated a lot. Right, I'll give you some more healing, David. I'll try and get, find out how I come in and the uh, only mm -hmm. thing coming in. Uh, I, I, I might use the different aspects of mine. Right, it's done. You didn't feel that, did you? You got like mm -hmm. a, a diamond shield on. I actually went, you got like a, I went to the other diamond and uh, yeah, they're sending in little spies. I don't know why. I'm not saying what I keep that one to myself. <laughs> Thank you. But, Thank you. Uh, the cockroach is gone too. Yeah. Remember, you 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 received a, the mineral download. Everybody received the last healing session. Received a, a mineral from Sirius download, and everybody that's here today is also receiving a download from Creator. That is a mineral from Sirius. Mm -hmm. It's not available on Earth, so you're going to get a download today. I don't know what the mineral is for, um, but. It is probably for what's going forward, it's going to be happening going forward. So, you know, he's not letting me know, but everybody that watches these videos will also receive the download of this mineral, and it's coming through your crown, crown of your head. Um, so know that that is going to be going into your bloodstream, into your bones, into your te your tendons, and every part of your body. So this mineral, um, what else should I? It's, he said, let me know that it is a form of protection. So know that you have this inside of you. He doesn't want to give me that much information. <laughs> <laughs> but you're all getting this download. And he uh, said, sorry. Go ahead. Yeah, the, the thing that how it got in closed off. It's not there. I can't get back. How we got it? Not going Deb. Sorry about that. You should you should feel a difference, David. A big difference going forward. Going forward. Yeah. Okay. Well, I certainly think I felt a bit better after the last healing set. Certainly more positive. And, yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, we had some creepy crawlies to go fry. I don't want any more, please. <laughs> We've had him come and go too. <laughs>
I don't mind the old goblin, but I think insects and spiders are a bit too much. Yeah, De- Deb phones me sometimes when she finds them. <laughs> Rick sees them. Oh. I, I just feel the energy. He sees them. Yeah. I don't have to see them. <laughs> Thank you. You got a card? Yes, please. Tell us where. Straight away now. You've got blessings from the angel. Oh, good. Thank you. Okay, yeah. you go, if you go through a difficult thing, you get an X. Hey, Victoria. Have, uh... She's come down and off. She here? Yeah, she's gone off again. Oh, okay. We'll come back to her. She says here, unable to get back on yet. Waiting. You're waiting. John. They're gone. She crashed twice. Okay. All right. Uh, Gina? Yes. Hi. How are you? Hello. Good. Hi, Gina. I'm good. You want to clear your past so you and your daughter... Yeah, I never d- done this before with You've anyone. You've never done it before? No. Let's see. What do you actually mean? You mean when you're younger or, or, or another life? Or, or past life? I'm, yeah, I'm in past life, so my do- my future generation will have better life. You know, like they said, it's connected to me and my daughter, and she's going through. And okay, so so really, you, you one of your last past lives, give it a shadow work on it or clear, you know, get rid of any residue. I won't be able to do them all. You might have had felt. <laughs> tell, tell me all that. <laughs> tell me all year. Uh, but let me see. Uh, I'll see what, what I can help. Uh, Deb, are you scan scan in there as well? I see one where. There was a very abusive relationship. Mm-hmm. Was it a father, daughter, abusive parent? Are you talking to me now? Yeah. Yes. I, yes. Um. This this life, my no, past. I, I no, no. The best. A past life. Oh. A past life. Yeah. Where it was a, fa- a father, daughter, abusive father. Mm. Were you a little boy? I'm trying to see if I think you were a little boy. You were a little boy, and he, the father, abused you. He beat you. He actually beat you to death. But it, it was a long, took many, it took years. But you eventually died from your injuries. He got too abusive one time, and, and you ended up dying. But it was, um, I think you were nine years old. That was one life. Deb, can you just yeah. double check that it wasn't a reversal where he beat? Um, oh, maybe. Okay, maybe it was. Do you want to just check? Yeah. Mm. Got alcohol. Okay. Don't matter. Which one it is, what you got to do is give them. Yeah. Uh, I mean, like a meditation, it's that art. Go back to that time, give everyone involved self bringing it here. Do you understand, Gina? S- send, send what I'm wearing. I'm picking it up. Uh, it, wasn't it, a... ju- it wasn't just that. I think it used to just uh, hire it out. Yeah. What you have to do is do the same. So give everyone, don't keep the bag, give yourself. How do you feel now, Gina? Do you feel any of that? Yeah, I feel okay. That last one, I wanted to go. got to say no. <laughs> I've done it before once. Mm. Got a card. Be army yes, now. But... Tell us when. No. Not far off army. Celebration. Mm. Celebration. It's a good. It's a good thing. It's all gone now. Those. Those. Uh... Uh, it means your life's changed. You. It's a celebration of your life. Mm-hmm. Yeah, thank you so much. You're welcome. Victoria's next. Victoria. Uh, she just got <laughs> Next uh, one. Celia, how's your husband? Okay. Um. So he had his uh, procedure last Wednesday. So, you know, the, the blood test that came back uh, said that he has, well, the cancer from the top, according to them, it's cancerous, but get out. I don't know how gonna, there's a hole on top of his head right um but the blood test came back says that he has stage three kidney disease he couldn't get his blood pressure down um, well the kidneys will affect your blood pressure was this after the operation sorry was this after the operation that check the, um no the blood this, pressure the blood pressure has been going on the time that he had the eye when the i remember track infection yeah yeah when i when i uh, sent in emergency sunday last sunday oh uh, I rem- i'll send him some email and i'm still here he won't sit in, he won't sit Enough. I remember. There enough. you go. Yeah. Just uh, say something. Celia, you talk. Okay, I'm talking. There we go. There we go. Hold on. Okay. My hands are. It's all right. There you go. Okay. You can put it down. My message is that he asked to experience it, but Phil will ignore that. You know. I know. But see, I that's I have to go by the rules because that's creator. Ah, uh, this is his. This was his kind of. This, this is part of his experience. Is your husband an angel? A what? Is your husband an angel? Did I don't know. I don't think we did that. He is. Yes. Right, Celia. So uh, one one kid is better. Uh, is it his life choice? It's an angelic. Yeah, he's an angelic. That's why he, this is his life choice. So he has to go. Through. It's not that he can. This the uh, the journey has to overcome this, this life. This was his choice of experiences in this before he incarnated. He chose, and many of the angels chose cancer. We came across one angel that chose four different. So he is an angelic. I have to let him know that. Yeah, I would definitely let him know that. <laughs> I would definitely let him know that, you know, no matter what, you're ending up in back in the angelic realm. <laughs> this is part of your journey. Do you want, do you want to tell the cats? Yeah. 
Yeah, I've, I've tried to do as much healing uh, stuff. Uh, so is I, it, hmm? is it uh, the left or the right kid? Good point, because I get it mixed up because I look at it in one position. I don't, I don't know if I looked at it in the back or the front. I'm looking at, I think it's the left. I it's think the left. left, yeah. Yeah, I've heard someone, uh, an operation went, went wrong because of someone got the left and right. The wrong, wrong one. Let's tell us one. No. Self accept. Is that? He has to accept. <laughs> Yeah, he should start loving himself more. Self accept, but accepting himself. Mm -hmm. you? Thank you. I love you. Uh, Victoria, are you still here? There's a frozen picture. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, I crashed like five times ago. They're after you. Oh, really? <laughs> it's been like this since last while. The uh, crazy Wi Fi doesn't seem to want to work. I'm not really sure. A number of reasons. She's, I wonder why she's not popping up for us. It says she's on mute, but I can hear her. So I'm not sure. I don't know. It's breaking things. Like, um, doesn't even look at those computers sometimes. Hmm? Doesn't even, it shows a blank for us, for her. Should I try to maybe re I think she said I'm going to try again. Hi, Don. Long time no see. Yes, well, I was just finishing dinner. Hello, everyone. Nice to see you. Hi. Uh, okay. So I think Cindy, Cindy Jumper is next. I think, or did I skip somebody? No. Cindy, Cindy. Hello. Why isn't she part? There we go. Hi, Cindy. There we go. Hi. You laying down? Um, I just had rotor cuff surgery two days ago. So I'm, um, yeah, I'm laying. <laughs> Let's see. Let's give you a scan and see what's going on. Do you want some healing? Healing. Certainly, yes. Thanks. Got little red faced men in her house. Still. Still? Yeah. Part of that red thing. Are you doing Ouija boards or something in your house? No, in fact, um, we just did a protection spell today. Do you have a Ouija board in your house? Not that I would know of. My, I know I don't. I know my daughter. Is there a portal there? Some kind of portal. I think this being created. There's Jeff telling me that it's some kind of Ouija. There's some kind of spiritual board there that's opening up. Is it? Does it have anything to do with the Indians and the the water? We have indigenous surrounding us, Rick and I. If it was anything to do with yeah. that, they would be telling me okay so they're they're so close to us believe me they would be telling there's they're shaking their heads yes they would be yeah the to stand up and tell us um it's nothing to do with native or um your water is is bad there we know that yeah the water yeah. is hot, but the water is bad in your area that's your government <laughs> Yeah. No, there's some kind of portal. Do you have a do you have a, do you buy old spiritual stuff? Um, I do. I wonder if we we usually try to, to cleanse everything before we bring it in. Um, you know, sage it. Wonder if we missed something. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll do a, there's, um, there's something with, there's something with the sun, moon, and stars on it. Do you have something the sun, moon, and stars on it? Maybe a Mercuba? Could what be as simple as calendar too. It, it's got it's it is it, what, they're using something that's got the sun, moon, and stars on it as a portal. Okay. You know how they have the sun with the face on it, and then the moon and the stars? It can be blocked using yeah. a signal. Use that type of signal to block. Just draw it straight on the item. A line crossing a line. Ask your daughter when, when she comes home. Okay. Oh, I, don't, I don't want you getting all upset. I just... No, it, it's making me her. wonder because um, I think she's got she's got an attachment. I don't know if that... Deb, do you want to check, mm. check for that again they're not there anymore uh, sign a contract it's not if it comes back again I'm not going to negotiate it's a little red imp sort of creature you know I, mean? I felt him right away again I just yeah. crazy but this time I, I I knew right away that they were coming through a portal and then they, I was getting the, the picture of the sun moon and stars something with sun moon and stars that they they might be correct they're now. coming in they might be correct now what no the, I was getting the message that, that they're coming through something that's got sun moon and stars on it that, that's the portal. Okay, we will look for that. It's gone now. So now I can heal you. I can't can't heal you when I when I feel those negative uh, beings there. Like the, the healing won't last. They're if they're there. I, I don't know why so they now, come in, now. I don't know why they come into what? Cindy's room. Why do they do? Well, the opportunity. Oh, some healing. Guys. Okay. Let's let's um take care of you now. Any stomach issue? Um. Yes. Like so you, the you can feel some uh, warmth there in your stomach and then down your back and in your hip. Got some pain. You mm -hmm. feel some warm and then in your yeah, neck and your shoulders down your arm down your leg basically from your chin down you're going to feel some warmth that's a nice healing and everybody in the room today is also getting the mineral from Sirius but it has not received it yet that's permanent it'll stay within your system mm, thank you feels much better did you see anything else Phil did you feel that though? yes I can um I feel like it where it kind of hurt where I know it hurts but then it just kind of fades stays with you for the next week wonder drink well, a lot of water 
bless, bless, bless your water. Yeah, I'm being a good bottle. Face. Good. We love you. We love you too. Always well. Tell, tell them when. It's your card. I never get a card. You guys are spoiled. <laughs> you did get a card. You said you'd have a wonderful time in Florida. Is it Florida? Tell us well. When did I get a when I get a card? Eight months ago. Yeah. <laughs> Say stop. I'll be sure for Oh, I said night. stop. Yeah. Serenity. Mm, nice. Nice. Peace of mind. Thank you. Marlene is next. Come on down, Marlene. Yeah. I want, to, I, I want to thank David for prompting this up. I've never brought it up before, but I feel like it's an old timeline playing out. It has to do with my thyroid. Um, I started feeling uh, the uh, negative sides of thyroid in 1998, and I've been taking uh, Synthroid pills, and I know that uh, it can heal. I just need help, guys. I need help. I feel, I feel like I've, I, I talked so much in my past lives that I need to stay without speaking many years in this one. Then I started speaking. <laughs> so. Do you want some healing as well, Mal? Well, yes. Sorry? Do you want some healing? Yes. And also, you I'll see if I can heal you. I'm looking, I'm looking at your thyroid, and um, I'm getting the, uh, the message from Creator. And he's telling me that you asked to experience what you're experiencing now. So he's also saying, keep your head in now instead of with that there if you're head in the now because you're missing the now you're missing what should, is right in front of you by looking back there we all do that we all sit there and go i miss what before i miss that and i miss the people or i miss who i was but then positive and some just don't do anything no, you got some you got some uh, gremlin in your house Gremlins? You got some red face ones. I can see them. Red face creatures. You got well, you, your portals. You know, those are still open. Yeah, they're they're open. Uh, Dad, Victoria was showing me some like white. And they didn't yeah, those. Them. Did yeah, you see the pla- the pla- those are plasma ones? Did I know, you see I know. those? <laughs> I've never seen videos I, I, of them before. <laughs> I have. They always come to me day and night. The ectoplasm. You know, they're always there. They don't feel. Those they, are beautiful. They're good. They're I nice. forgot to I forgot to show them to Rick. We've been so I've been so um caught up with um. Reinhardt and that's a whole nother story that yeah, I, Reinhardt I have to tell you has guys, certain but, um, energies with him he's he's um he's very ill very ill um uh, yeah, but as well that's what you took a picture Rick, of. look at those do not look amazing it's, that. Uh, Victoria sees can you see you it don't see things like that right mm-hmm. yeah I have the Buddhas plasma. and I have hmm? the Buddhas and those are um, beautiful other light beings that come and I take pictures of them and they let me so and that that's like a building that's dimensional that can you see the little white light like, like a, that is amazing. Oh, these things that are is, in my house. I see them every day, so I don't, you know. They're not amazing. <laughs> they're amazing. She's I, got I, some I, little red face ones, though, but um, I think one. that the, the light beams, the light beams. Look at Auntie Debbie. Look at Auntie Debbie. He's so old. His eyes, today they look old. They, they haven't until today. Bobby, Bobby. Look at that. Okay, good, good boy. He just told me I'm so. Yeah, he is. He just said. It's because he's also like struggling with his breath sometimes and it doesn't help. It really tired. And the energy at the home is, uh, you know, difficult for him. He said, said, I don't know how much longer I can do this. I know. I do know that. Because yesterday when, when I was walking him to, you know, he wanted to go to the park and he, um, you know, he was getting tired coming back. It didn't help with him kind of coughing and choking away before going. Um, you know, he still has that. It's difficult, I know. That has a lot to do with his age, though, too, Tori. Yeah. Yeah. He'll be 14 next month. I know. I'm giving him a bit of energy. You go every month. I give him. Sorry? I give him a bit of energy every time. Really. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. We, we had an hamster one. My kids didn't. And they, the world records for him. Today, you know, he didn't, today he didn't eat that much, so it won't give him too much energy if he's not eating right he Sorry. refuses dog food and you know eating more human food that's choice he just doesn't want to eat dog food like you know i think that's all dog food. Hmm? yes all, dog, all dogs are like I, I was given some uh frostbite shot two months i gave it the dog from uh and afterwards trying to get it on dog they, they don't like prefer do uh, you want a card sure i did healing in his throat and his respiratory thank you and then oh, as well. oh sorry um now Serenity again. I do shuffle them well. Serenity again. Okay. Can I get a card for Bobby? Yeah. Yep. Peace of mind is within you. Stop worrying. Uh, for Bobby, tell us. Is Bobby going to tell me where? Uh, he's kind of uh, <laughs> trying to sleep or something now. Uh, uh, when? 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 Divine time. It's two cards today throughout <laughs> throughout the Zoom session. It's the same two cards. It is, isn't it? It's crazy. crazy. Yeah. I do shuffle them well. I've got a full pack. So divine timing. So what does that mean here? It's, um, it's like Bobby's prayers are being answered on. How would you make 
it's Bobby's prayers are being answered in universe law. So I don't know. How would Bob, how would, Sorry, what did you say? How, how would it fit in with Bobby? I mean, how, um, you've got to know what his prayers are. I, I do know what he wants. He's trying. He's trying to stay. He's trying to be with me. He's trying to support me. Otherwise, he would have left. He had that. He had that um, opportunity to leave uh, that, at that time, the exit gate. But he's trying. So I don't know how I'm going to be able to change everything around for him. Even if I stay most positive, the home environment, his age, you know. Um, you have you know, to give him permission to leave, though. You have to tell him that whenever he's ready, it's okay. So he feels bound to me then. He's very bound to you he loves you i know he loves you and doesn't want to leave you i know he i don't want to leave him too you know he even though he's ready he won't leave you is what i mean but, but sometimes how, how does that work i mean like if 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 you i'm like even if I he's just, suffer, even if he's suffering he's going to try and stay unless, yes unless you tell him it's okay if you would like to go understand okay. that dogs don't carry their trauma and they do yeah. they reincarnate very quickly i know um so for example like there are dogs that that i know and Matt that are like 19, 20 year old. I mean, I don't even know how that's even possible. But how how is it that they could live so long while normal like most dogs only like survive like 13 to 15 years some dogs only six to seven years yes yeah, yeah, yeah. depends on their breed yes um, some of them can be like energy vampires take the energy off the owner and you wonder why the owner doesn't look well <laughs> oh, really <laughs> so if i give yeah, him and, energy you, know, you have the ones that are his age that are blind and deaf and he's not true true because he's he's like a six-year-old yeah he's in really good shape for his yeah he's, he's, you're probably giving him loads of energy <laughs> Yeah. So as long as I keep um, keep nourishing him, keep loving him, he, yeah, he would feel better. He, he should have like sweet potatoes and carrots in his food. Yeah, but I don't know if he'll eat those. He'll eat them if, if, if they're cooked, you know, with like chicken, with sweet, sweet potato and carrots and a little bit of rice. This guy is quite, um, quite picky in a way. Have you ever tried it? I've had um, different foods from when he was younger and he won't eat a lot of food. He's very picky, this guy. This guy eats the most expensive dog food and you know everything he eats is expensive <laughs> i mean i'm not kidding even the expensive in the human aspect you know what i mean for like we you know we can't always afford duck every day and this guy get duck almost every day and you know lamb steak you know because he won't eat the other so he doesn't really fancy chicken this guy so this guy eat whatever he likes and i give him whatever he likes you know um you victoria know how our dog has cheapest dog food if you don't eat it it's going to be there later on <laughs> It's sad uh, to eat it, and if you don't eat it, you're not going to eat. Yeah, he he's been eating uh, like the the world canine, um, the Pomeranian brand since he was little. So you know, so one bag here in Canada come close to thirty dollars, and that's only like what the three pound bag or something, two and a half three pound bag. So it's not cheap what he eat. But you know, he he stopped eating uh, dog food in general, but he likes eating dog treats like duck jerky, all the meaty type of thing. Um, there's a lot of food he won't eat, like the milk bones, uh, anything that's processed, too processed, but he'll eat the stuff that is like more meaty. Yeah, yeah They should have vegetables. So will he eat apples? He doesn't always eat. No, uh, he may eat the odd, um, what do you call that? The Chinese Asian pear, you know, that Asian pear? Yeah. The odd the odd little bit. When a lot of people not happy. I suppose restrictions are still kicking in here and it's just feels like it's getting whatever's happening in Germany and Austria is gradually starting to I mean, there is, is riots come across. Uh, Ed, is rioting in all every day to go into France. Yeah, I saw that. The funny thing is, I, I don't watch mainstream media, but yet when I visit my mum, you know, the, 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 the normal mainstream doesn't show any, you know. It says like there's a few hundred and rot, there's thousands out protesting. But it's just with working things because when they're pushing this cure, which, you know, this is the thing. So I don't know what's coming down over the next few weeks, potentially. I, we're looking at maybe locking here again, even though we're still semi-locked down anyway, but it seems to be potentially heading that direction for the 5% that hasn't taken the cure, they say, in this country. There's no logic in any of it at all. But it's just not to get involved because when you're listening to it all the time, it's, it's not good. You know, it does really brings you down. What about the people that haven't taken the jab? What are they doing to them? Oh, you can't go anywhere. I mean, as in you can't go into a restaurant, can't you have to have your 
pass, your bloody passport. Um, so yeah, there's there's no going into shops, yet, no problem moments, but it's um, all uh, restaurants, pubs, cinemas, all that thing. You can't get in. So it's kind of strict. Huh? And yet, what, 5% they say? I mean, I don't like st- statistics. <laughs> they change on a daily basis anyway. The thing is, they're pushing the, the booster, which now um, there's not a strong uptake on this. So I think people are starting to, you know, but we have a bit to go here. A lot of people are sleeping this, this country, I feel. But anyway, <laughs> but let's see, um, Phil. Yeah. You, you you said something's going to happen this month. Mm-hmm. End of the month. First to be bigger. First to be a relief of uh, energy. I've heard that from so. a few sources. Yeah, I've heard that from a few sources. Earthquake where? Yeah. I'm not saying. <laughs> 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 it's a big one it's one of the biggest but it's going release and energy mm-hmm. yeah uh, the, the, the crystals underneath the earth are, uh, en- uh, started about four or five months ago and the energy in that will go through oh, wait most a lot of people yeah no, I, I've heard that from a few sources actually so it's kind of yeah. making there's, sense there's going to be um, a lot happening in the next few months and if there's going to be a solar, just... a solar flare as well yeah, the, yeah. Uh, people are, are, are the blind ones are, are not going to have a choice but to wake up and, and many are going to leave actually there's a lot leaving here at the moment a lot of people are leaving dying yes yeah yes. quite a, quite yeah. a lot really yes. much more so than last year well, in, in Austria out of a million people they've got 15 un- have got COVID and they're doing full lockdown that's nothing if you look at the ratio 15 un- these are, but these are all vaccinated people yeah uh, well in the UK like in the UK now we can go everywhere in Wales can't which, so I'm not going to Wales for the holiday <laughs> and uh, what what, what they're trying to pull in is if you haven't had the booster, you're not vaccinated. So they'll have all the figures of the dead as not vaccinated, but they've had two vaccines. It's a scam. <laughs> yeah, it is. Oh, it's a, a complete scam. scam. Um, There's yeah. obviously an agenda there. It's gone, it's gone, you know, it's well planned. Well, well planned. Mm. I suppose everything happens for a reason too, doesn't it? Maybe, you know, you have it's, to look it, at that it's, side of it. It's woken a lot of people up to our history. It's not artist history, it's just a made up history. Oh, absolutely. So did you did you need a healing or a scan today? Um yeah, I do yeah, I wouldn't mind one. Um I just feel really tired lately. I I'm not clearing myself, I think is part of it. Just probably because I I, I with my work I do me every day because I'm teaching as well. So I've lots of energies come in and out. I had a feeling. <laughs> I saw so I, I saw you sitting there and and you've um you haven't been to one of these, so you really didn't know what the protocol was. So I didn't want you to <laughs> I was, Not, yeah, I was late this one. Yeah. I've seen a few of them. Obviously. Yeah, I haven't. Uh, and I was surprised to part. see. I was very happily surprised to see you. <laughs> well, I, had, I, I was just like, come back from work and I actually fell asleep for half an hour. And then I said, hey, I may, I'll just log on. <laughs> I'm, here. I'm glad I'm glad you came. So let's uh, you. let's do a scan. I'll do it. Okay. Oh, well, you've got an attachment. Makes sense. Surprise, surprise. You've got a, you've got a lost soul. You've got a couple of lost souls. Pure energy. Yeah. His name is Edwin. Is that funny? Your name's Ed and his name is Edwin. <laughs> he's 72 years old he hasn't been there long he's it's on your back and near your lungs covid it's a very chatty man it was your light it was your energy so i explained about a god spark in his heart and he's very anxious to have the same light that you had so he now has the same light that you have mary mary, mary mag you may feel um a heat or vibration in your back yeah, he's He's uh, pulling himself away. And I'll do any uh, matter. Sometimes don't do a little yeah. damn part. He's saluting you. <laughs> He's on his way. The other one's name is Peter. He was down lower on just above your root chakra around your waist. It's been there a little longer. Say like the end of September. Motorcycle accident. Archangel Michael's here. Uh, the chat room. Uh, <laughs> Ed, you haven't had the back. No, I haven't. The reason why is the old man said, why is it? I've got, I've got to say this. Why is it that all the souls on dim around, around? You get that? All the ones that have had the back. I've never heard that. That was so... What did he say? He that said, was... Oh, sorry, he, he said a lot of the souls around, a lot of the people walking are on dim. Huh. The energy's on dim. That's quite wow. strange. I didn't want to look a fool in it today. I've had to like <laughs> that's why that's why they go in. That's why they did well. Okay, so he's gone with Archangel Michael now. So your lower back is and your hips need heal. And their energy would also make you a little depressed. As what I'm picking up, you pin up a lot quite a lot of negativity up around. A bit more grounding, maybe a bit more nature, a bit more organ tree. What happens is it, it when your head gets full with negativity, 
obviously it, it goes to weak point, you get pain, or like we get arthritis or joint pain, or whatever. Yeah, <clears throat> that makes sense. Picking up and makes keeping a lot of sense. it. So, so a bit more grounding, but there's a lot okay. of negative people around. So just have to shield yeah. yourself from them. <laughs> I just feel for the last particular, a, a loss yeah. everywhere where I am, anyway. Um, yeah. Remember who you are. <laughs> Yeah, true. We're almost there. That's why I keep reminding myself the odd time. Got this far. <laughs> and contact us. We have these a couple times a month. Get together with people that are, you know, we're all, you know, and, and if we have to have a, like, if, if you need to just get together with a bunch of us, contact us. We'll throw a Zoom together. Yeah, because... <laughs> it, yeah, it's it's uh, quite difficult. I notice even where I am now to find people like this because it's like zombie land out there now. Yeah, we, just... we all have the same thing. We'll just yeah. get together then. We'll have to, yeah. I'll, you know, let me know. We'll, we'll throw a Zoom together. Let's all just sit and chat. <laughs> <laughs> you got a card though. sounds good you got a card yes please yeah. just say stop okay stop I, I think it's nature but I never get these right <laughs> that's a myth here yeah. guardian angel that's that's pretty good. Uh, you guardian angel get close to you but say cheers he, thanks he's behind you <laughs> <laughs> so if you need a bit of help okay, we've got another one Jillian G- oh, uh, Gabriel first oh Gabrielle Gabrielle first sorry Jillian Gabrielle first hello hello you're late I am <laughs> <laughs> I was a sleepy girl. <laughs> it's, it's only two o'clock. Eight. Your mother, yeah. your mother was before you, and uh, you guys live in the same house. Yeah. Okay. So she told you. Yes, about the gremlin thing and the sun, moon, and stars. I've been trying to think what that might be. Okay. Um, did I miss anything else? Okay. I wasn't for no Ouija board, right? Oh. Mom said, no, no Ouija board. Dad was always very, you need to stay on the light side of things. Well, mom too. He was like, be like your mom. But um, mom said this was the only thing she could find that had the star and the moon thing on it. It's like Did a wax. Where does that come from? Um, We got it at Goodwill or something. It was somebody like else's. A, Is it a second hand one? Yeah, it's like second hand. That, that well I usually so, try to that, sage stuff, but like I could have forgot. That well feels like, that does feel like something to do with it. Okay. <laughs> I wouldn't get rid of it though. But I'll think about. I'll be looking at stuff now with the another pair of eyes. Program a crystal and put it for it, or put three around okay. it. Trying. Um, no moon picture behind me. I do like sun, moon, and stars is like my stuff. Like if you see my room, there's a lot of colorful, like spacey type stuff. But I don't <laughs> like. I've... Gabrielle, is your is your room in the lower level? I'm in the front of the house we live, in, but. Uh, when we moved in, like I did, like do like a vortex with uh, Mark Zinzow for the house to like bring positive energy. Like when I first got into energy healing, and I don't know if that is affecting it. He had a portal outside his house with his guides, like where he lives. So we did that here. I'm not sure if that was what it was. Do you guys have a feeling? He created a portal. That? Did you say he created? Yeah, like a what was it? Yeah, a vortex, like to like uh, boost your energy and like talk to your guides easier and stuff so that's what the purpose was when we first did it but maybe that's what is bringing everything you know but i know we were doing it for like positive intent but now it might be caused but that was the only thing i could think of because normally you know i just do my <laughs> prayers and candles and stuff like that but where did he where is the vortex create you put yourself on me my bad thing yeah. um over the house or uh at first it was like in the my front bedroom and then um like for the house protection we did something for that like to put a protection around the house because we were dealing with some stuff stuff at the time but do you want to say something there i don't really want to criticize anything i wouldn't create a vortex hmm? that's a, it's not a vortex it's a portal okay that's the portal what, so okay so what do i do now yes okay for some reason i see that it's under if you're living in a in a trailer it's there but for some reason that little vase you have is what they're using huh interesting uh, when did you get that yeah. I don't know. Um, it was mom's. Do you remember when you got... Where was that little vase? It's frozen. And she might have gotten left for Florida. So there... Was, so, it, be- was, it, was it before yeah. you moved to that house? So, yeah. So the, the, before we went to the house, it was Florida. Okay, so... 
But when he put that right. wherever we did, we did unpack things. So the portals underneath the house, and when they come in, they use that vase from underneath the house into the into the house. They come through that vase or that candle or whatever that thing is. Okay. Are you sure okay. the wax melt burner? Yeah, it's a wax <laughs> melt burner. Like, yeah, like, yeah, that is. Yeah, that's what it is. Really not. My feet are going crazy. So it's definitely. I felt it was underneath. Underneath. Um, it's a. I don't know what it is in America. Is it like a huge caravan that you live? In? Yes, it's a, it's a, it's a manufacturer. Yeah, like home. a trailer. Yeah. Oh. I, yep, from yep. when you've said, I felt it was on the wall, what it like it was coming through a picture. Hmm. I'm not saying it, it definitely is. That's why I thought there was a picture on the wall. Wow. Mom, Mom just brought me this. It was mm-hmm. something that she colored, My- and it does have sun, moon, and stars on it. Yeah. Oh, there it is. There it is. That's what uh, I. That's your Ouija board. That's your Ouija board. Yeah. There it is. That's it. Oh, I never would have. Oh, okay. There it is. We've got now what do we do with it? What, 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 what the vortex is doing, I've been told, the vortex connects to the energy lines of the Earth, connecting to the to probably the underworld. That's a red imp. It's not a goblin. It's like, it's like a goblin's eye in the underworld. It's a red imp. So you you basically, your caravan is connected to the underworld and it's bring, it can bring any of You've got like a like a, a, port, a portal to there. There you go. Do you want to keep Do you want to keep it? <laughs> no, no. <laughs> I want to get rid of it. I think you'd understand it better if you just said it was a gateway, an yeah. access point. Yeah, a gateway to the underworld. The underworld is so, a really nice place. Yeah, the, the, but we can be a bit mixed. <laughs> cre- the creatures. Yeah. So we're getting like how rid of like uh, something like that. Uh, we've we got, we got to close it. Okay, you're back. The, the thing is, it hasn't done okay. any damage. It hasn't done any damage. So it's it is definitely it's not an evil spirit. If you know, it's not evil. Anything. It's just it's uh, worrying right. what it could do and what else can come through. Anything. Mom, oh, that's gonna okay. It closing. T- Shall I close it? Dad? You, you make sure you're not <laughs> How did he create it? Um, we we did it in my room, like uh, in like a circle formation to like uh, a rich, rich also. Right, but at the time it was more so kind of going with the flow because I'm like, okay, he has one, but it's not tech- next to his house, so I didn't think we were at the time doing anything bad because he didn't have anything or not to mind so i thought it was more like to soak in the gifts i wasn't thinking of like uh, that it being attached it, it, to it, it's uh, it's like creating ley line building sort of thing so you boosting your energy power but you can also uh-huh. have uh, like a gateway okay <laughs> no no i have to yeah, Deb, do you want to just check two way one? I don't see it. You could have actually traveled to the underworld where you live. <laughs> no, thank you. Oh, you're talking to me or them? <laughs> <laughs> it, it, it was the good side. Didn't it? No, okay. um, I put uh, white crystalline energy throughout the house, inside and outside, and I put a blanket of protection around you. Thank you. Oh. <laughs> that was crazy. <laughs> uh, last, t- last time we were on here, I, didn't I close a portal? It was in your side. I think I didn't get the you one picked, underneath. You I, picked I, up on something last time. I don't. It was a gremlin last time too. It was <laughs> yeah, an it's, peanuts... it's an in a little red thing. Or is that another one? It was a red thing <laughs> last time. Yeah, and Peanut's been barking randomly at stuff. I'm like, I'm not in any mice or anything, but he'll just start going. Wah, 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 wah. You, you can know, see, yeah. you can see them. Yeah. Google, Google, red in. You'll, okay. you'll see what you were seeing. Little mm-hmm. snarly, look. Maybe you look like goblins, but without the yeah, more red. Chibi. Maybe it'll help my sleep better Chibi. too. Like I've been having really hard time mm-hmm. sleeping when I have nightmares. So they'll be, be probably messy. Yeah. Oh. Gabrielle, do, do you need a card? Need a card? Um. Yes, please. Thank you, guys. And what I'd recommend everyone try and do a grounding at the end because last week I didn't. I uh, did a bit of help. Okay. I, I, I got burned. Tell us why. Stop. Never. Enchantment. The universe. That's the underworld. <laughs> oh really? <laughs> Yeah, I actually saw you in the as well. Well, thank you guys. I really appreciate it. Yeah, our, our enchantment is you've got to, I think it was weird how it's enchantment because that's in that world, but you've got to also connect with the inner child and have a bit more fun. You're not doing this enough. You need more, you need to be more childlike. That something. makes you. But I'm amazed that that's the card. I can't. <laughs> it's apropos. Right, thank you. And Jillian is the last one. Hi. Hi. Hello. Rick's tucking in Ziggy because he was screaming to tuck him in. Sorry. Oh. He wouldn't. Uh, he won't shut up and she'll talk about bedtime see he's quiet he'll be right back. 
spoiled birds. Oh, they're not. This runs sweet. in the middle of it. Love them so much, though. Can't. Ziggy hates it usually. Has Jillian gotten over life? I kiss, I kiss him, but he doesn't kiss them. <laughs> what did you say, Phil? Have you got another layer to get rid of? Ooh, something and something um, came in through my crown again. What happened? Oh, um, no. I was in bed. I'd done my grounding, clearing, protecting. Was about to nod off. It wasn't as um, it was very. I had a very high. Um, it came in through my crown. I was like, I was a bit uncertain about because it, it felt gentler than the last time. And then I thought, no, nothing positive's ever coming through my crown. I've, I've um, done angelic rape for and they've never, they always come in and merge with your energy. They never come in through the crown like that. And I'm energy sensitive anyway. When you were with just with the lady, sorry, I don't know her name because I came in late. Um, straight away, my feet were grounding, telling me the energy was going both ways in my feet. So I knew that that portal was going both ways. Um, but it didn't, it didn't feel like that. It was just to say, it just merged with me. It was like a very strong static merged with my body, but it came through my crown. Okay, did it feel like a mineral? No, it just, it was just, um, that's the only way I can describe it. It was like, you know, when you remove the other thing, because I don't want the dark thing, it was, it was like, it was a frequency that came in. Because at the moment, I'm hearing multiple frequencies um, and they've been very high all day, but there's an underground bass frequency that I'm hearing at the moment on top of the high frequencies. But this just came in and with the strongest vibration came in. Did it feel like a, a feel like a person, like a, a being? I couldn't tell. I couldn't or tell. Did it feel me. like a down? No, I usually get downloads through the frequency. It sounds like clicking, like Morse code. I normally hear never a click. Gotten, um, no, I've never, I've never gotten Yeah, when um, I get a down, sounds like um, the frequency that I hear sounds almost like Morse code within the frequency. Mm -hmm. I've never, apart from the end, the dark thing that you moved before, it was the same as that, but it came in at a higher gen frequency. I don't, I'm not getting anything that's negative like before. Yeah, because I thought I'm not having it because you haven't asked and you haven't communicated with me. So I was like, no, out you go or partially out you go. Sometimes we have difficulty. It's just, yeah, yeah, I get that. But um, with the experience that I had for, I was just like, no, you're not coming in through my crowd. And, and that sudden. I get I, um, I, I, I get I, I thought it was a high vibration. Um, my eyes have been off again this week. So I, I've had most of the week in bed. And yesterday when I was walking around, I had to close one eye to be able to balance, if that makes sense, when I was walking. Um, something's been tapping me all the time. Um, and I'm, I'm a bit confused because I'm not sure where the Metron's been around me, as well as it felt elemental. But I'm not saying it definitely was because when I've got, a lot going on I can't always you know split what's actually what it actually is when you say tapping just saying it aloud tapping. when I physically feel things on on my body so I can be lying there and something will literally it's like if somebody was sitting next to me tapping the fingers on my leg or my arm my shoulder I physically feel it you can if, some, if you were sitting next to me as well say my daughter I mean she won't look now but if you could actually see my skin move I've always had that that's um that's how um I was was first aware of a spirit animal because I used to go um, to visit cousin and I sat there like stunned because I was like you've got a panther and it's just put its paw on my knee and it was so gentle but so powerful I mean when was the last time you had a big wild cat put its paw on you on your knee and she got a bird and it flew and it parted my hair at the back I couldn't tell you what bird it was but she'd got a bird so I've always been since for about well I'd say about seven years um aware of spirit animal so I couldn't figure out what the the tapping but that's been constant I'll give you some healing Jillian I'll, I'll see if you Jillian what I'm, I'm getting I'm getting that your energy sometimes going to be in the yeah. what you are you're not just in this dimension you're, you're like over in yeah and um, what happened when I came out of hospital um, was um, it just spontaneously happened and mm. um, my daughter made me laugh and I had this and I've never experienced pain like and um, I was told by um, Ross Sugar, you know Leo, don't um, that I'd gone, because he did it as well, but I'd done it spontaneously. I'd gone down every timeline, and the only thing that rang me in was the pain in my knee. I'd got uh, pain, pain in my knee from when I 
had fallen downstairs and I was focusing on the pain in my knee. And when I came back, because we were eating a meal at the table, I was as white as a sheet and dream. I didn't know what had happened, but I just knew I felt like death. Uh, so we had a session with him and he um, said, I'd just been down every timeline. And I think I'm still in bits of places mm. because I bought back at one point, I had an, a past life self with me. I was aware of him um, like a soldier mm. and he was protecting me shoulder from a past life wound I'd bought back with me from the timeline. It was from here. And so I've been doing like lots of things. But like you say, the tapping, usually it's um, spirit animals for this past Two years, I don't has been, and I haven't been able to, like you say, differentiate what they are. And so, yeah, I, I would say you're right. Yeah, you're probably over in 4D, 3D, or glowing. Yeah, you're not. Yeah, your own physical not anchored here. <laughs> you get what? Yeah, yeah. Highest. <clears throat> <clears throat> <clears throat> I think the highest I've been consciously aware of was to the 12th when I needed um, to use a Metatron shield. But I'm, like I say, I couldn't consciously tell you where bits of me are, but like I say, I can physically feel it. I'm wondering if that could be something to do with my eyes. It can be quite difficult in eye diamond. For me, I know we merge an eye, an aspect of my... You might, you might have an aspect gate in that Yeah, that's eye. what I... If I've been down all the timeline, I'm like, say I think I've got a photo at the time I had I was like why I've got this compulsion to take a photograph of myself at the time when I'd done it and uh, yeah I looked like I've been dug up <laughs> literally did look like I've been dug up it was, like I say it was so painful so um, probably I've connected with um, so many aspects I, I, I was, yeah I once uh, was taking a, a very high dimensional being back through a week and I told the medium the medium wished it in her she he yeah. never did but he did and I said don't look at me and I had changed to Hermie on Atlantis an alien yeah. I frightened her to death <laughs> so you can merge and you can actually look like the actual being that you are so I, I think it's a very high being that I travel on. really interesting about you saying that because um, afterwards I ke- became aware of um, there was a, a period of time where I was like am I going a bit crazy like the Greek gods are real <laughs> they're like massive their energy was coming back that makes yeah it was it was around that time I'd say 18 months ago maybe just a touch more and I was aware then um, I was aware of Merlin and it was, it was, he got a bit crazy I was like why is Merlin giving me his art why do I need what are you giving my friend was like that's one of my aspects really so I'll ask him <laughs> yeah he got like uh, and then um a lady tried to do past life regression with me and um, she'd got about three recording devices. She's she's quite, quite, um, she's become quite well known over a short time uh, here. She um, did some training with Alba Wyman and um, it, that was really strange because he switched off all the recordings at the end and she said, I haven't got a thing. <laughs> I didn't go in. I, what I was talking to her, I, I'm talking to you now. I lost a, a certain name. I didn't need to go under hypnosis but that really annoyed me because I wanted to be hypnotised because I wanted my subconscious to come forward not I didn't want to do it consciously yeah but um, now do we having that said it yeah because she said I want, she said do I have your permission for it on YouTube and I said no not at this moment I said I'm getting it not at this moment it's not ready and she, when she looked she said I couldn't do it if I wanted to she said because I had a feeling this going on I set it up with three and all three of been turned off so it's really strange because I got really cross man so I'm like I've got free will what you're messing up <laughs> it's my decision <laughs> yeah because well, I'm like I'm here now I'm completely incapacitated because at that time I could I couldn't even walk without somebody assisting me I hadn't even got the strength to push a button down on a kettle or anything yeah it's like, o- o- obviously yeah. that, the aspects that were very they, 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 the job you got here they don't want I just think um, I feel like um, might sound crazy but it's like um, instead of dying in 
person being reincarnated, it feels like it's happening in the body, if that makes sense. Like being rewired, because it, uh, how can I put it? When Oakley was born in the January, by the time the relaxed lockdown here, he'd got more muscle control than I had, and I didn't realize till he came visit. So I'm just really glad that it's not negative because <laughs> I was thinking, oh God, what have I got this time? Because I'm not tuning into it. I'm like, I refuse to connect. I'm not yeah, feeding yeah. anything. We, we all have got very, if you've very, got a very like godlike aspect, imagine the negative sort. It's like it's got to be calmer. So it's come. Kind of, well, yeah. that, that's not came through very strongly for me before. And I'm, I've, I've said it to loads of people. If you experience the extreme in, in, on the scale, the exact opposite to the exact extent available to you at some point. I, I'm supposed to be the, uh, I was the king of the nine hours. So yeah, I get that. I was yeah. a hundred foot long serpent creature. So I don't want to be connected to that one. Uh, no, no thanks. I feel like my third eye is being utilised for something else because I aren't seeing. I'm, I've watched. I've lost the visual. Is 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 that um perm- a permanent thing? Do you think I'll get that back then? There's always a reason why. It could be because you're being messed about. You've got a lot of layers. You probably need well, to clear. When it was, when it was um, the angelic ray, I'm just kissing it. Can say there. Yeah, I can say that. Um, I see third, it done. I mm-hmm. used to use my, my third eye. The healing. I used to um, channel white light, and it was I, almost used like a laser. I do that. Yeah. <laughs> if, if I've got mm-hmm. someone lying down and I'm on the head, I put my third eye and I use my third eye for healing because it's like direct energy. Yeah, it was almost like. Yeah, a, you're the first. Laser. You're the first that said that. I, I just have to check whether I was like can I say that can't <laughs> can it? But yeah, it, 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 I felt I'd say that I felt quite relaxed. I didn't get a tense feeling about it. Yeah. Um, just really strange that you know. I haven't got that visual at the moment, but it'll come back. I'm just, really, I'm just really pleased it wasn't negative. No, I didn't see anything negative either. And I, I got a message from Father that's saying, there's nothing wrong with your third eye either. Oh, well, strange. Don't accept that. It's oh, not, well, I don't. Yeah. Don't it's not one kind of thing. Yeah. Just when I, when I go to Lou, I, I, you know, it's just at the moment. Perhaps something needs balancing. No? I don't. Yeah, I'm not seeing anything. He's, he's telling me there's nothing wrong with your third eye. Well, that's good. That's something good then. Thank you. Thank you. Can I have a card, please, Phil? Yeah. It'd probably say your third eye's blocked. <laughs> I'm joking. <laughs> I'm joking. <laughs> Uh, tell us one. Um, stop, please. Uh, you, why do cards keep on coming? I shuffled them. I really did. Enchantment. Enchantment. More, more play that, isn't it, with you in a child? Uh, um, with yourself. More fun. More fun. As soon as you said that, um, your childhood felt, magic. Yeah, yeah. Um, unicorn energy. I think now if there's enough clearing, I need filling up with the good stuff. I think don't look at your third eye not working. You think it's not. I think if you started yeah. being more childhood magic, so, uh, yeah. children can see, do a lot more than what we can normally because uh, they haven't got blocks that create our own. So if you can become your your child within the magic. Deb, I've just had a thought. My third eye now the back of my head I just got a feeling because before um when I merged with my one of my higher self aspect as she came in um I could see through the back of my head you come in from your back no I could see I could see, see the wall, the radiation. I could see. It was really weird. It was like, um, I suppose like you'd have a CCTV camera or, you know, the security dome. I could see out the back of my head. Wow. That could be your mind's eye. Your mind's eye could no, go anywhere. No idea. But I remember thinking, why can I see the wall and the light switch and the radiator out the back of my head? I just wondered if perhaps it was it was that not what I thought it was, not the fun. It, it's your mind's eye. Your mind's eye can see anywhere. The, the um, concept. Straight to your mind's eye and seeing the back. Okay, then. Why, why he did that, I don't know. He might have been seeing something trying to eat all your stuff coming to the back. I think at the time I'd done um, clearing because at the time as I was clearing, I'd, I'd got my flash. My head was jerking back. You know, like when you see these um, movies on TV when they go like through portals and you think like, or even when you see spaceship like rockets taking off and they throw back. My yeah. head was just jerking back about two times and then. And she'd come in before, but I'd pushed her 
anyway. Mm. And it was always an inopportune moment when um, everybody was in bed and she'd talk to me through telepathy and I'd feel her come in and I'd be like, oh, who are you? You, you are not now, not, no thank you, not at midnight, no thank <laughs> And she'd keep to me for it and then she'd go. But she uh-huh. just came in and told me she'd been with me. I can't even remember the number, it was that big. She just said she'd been with me a long time and she merged with me for a bit. I had three on the box, one I pushed out. Hey, hey, John, is um, Trish there? Because I want to do a healing. Thank you, but thank you, everyone. Bring her thank over. You. Davina wants you to pick a card, Deb. Go on. Yeah. Say, say stop. When? I said stop. Stop. <laughs> oh, why are the same cards coming? I mean, this serenity. serenity. Serenity? Yeah. Peace of mind is within you. And what about Rick? Quick it. Quick it. One sec. Let me just properly shuffle these. Right, go on. Tell us one. Stop. <laughs> I don't know. Romance. I need more new cards. <laughs> wow. Your prayers for love of being answers. <laughs> Where is she? <laughs> <laughs> Which dimension is she in? <laughs> yes. Yeah. So we need to do some healing on Trish. She's sitting down. She has um <clears throat> this is uh Don's wife. Hi Trish. Hi. Hi. Say hi. Say hi. Hi. Everybody can hear you. Hi, hi. Trish. Hi. Hi. You can hear us okay? Yes. 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 You look very pretty today, Trish. I like your glasses. Those are the new ones. Hey. Trish, you may feel some warmth going through the top of your head. <laughs> Do you feel some? Do you feel some warmth going through your head? Some tingling? Warm, warm in your. Hmm? Do you feel warm in your head? Yes. She says yes. Did healing in her breast, uh, Don? Thank you. It's a left breast. Down her hip, in her hips, in her legs as well. Thank you. Uh, her elbows and her wrists. I think she's got some arthritis happening there. She's been playing with her her elbows or her wrists or ha- her um hands. Uh, yes, hands. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, she can go. You want a card, Phil? You want a card, honey? Yeah, go. Mm -hmm. Just, just say yes. You want a card? (laughs) Just say when. (laughs) Tell Phil yes, sir. Tell Phil yes. I want a card now. Just, (laughs) just tell him when. Right when you're ready. Ready. There you go, Phil. And faithfulness. Faith. What's that? Faithfulness. 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 Faithful in your journey. Thank you, Phil. I got that for 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 yep. sure. You're ready to rain now. Now mop the floor for me. <laughs> 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 I'm just kidding. I'm not that harsh. <laughs> oh, thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. You're welcome, Trish. Okay. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome, Trish. We love you. How about you? You need some healing? I don't really know. Might as well do me do a scan. And we'll do the card pull. I don't want to be left out. I need some energy. Uh, right yeah, your back and your hips are a little off there, buddy. Your knees can do a tune up. Your shoulder going on with your shoulder and your neck. You have a lot of stress. What's that? Are you under stress at the moment? Yes, he is. Yeah, well, yes, he is. I had to take, I, I had, to, well, Trish, Trish is always, this case is always uh, on my mind. Um, right now, we have a lot of flooding, and I've opted to take three days off. We're still getting paid for them, but I've take, I've canceled three days of my Christmas holiday to subsi- subsidize. Otherwise, you're going to be laying guys off the bottom pole. That's not good. Yeah, what, what happens? Release mingle. <coughs> We both have the mineral download as well. I'm still getting time for you to retire. Time for you to retire. <laughs> Thanks, Dad. <laughs> time for you to stay home. I want to make it to March. I know. I know Trish is going to let you walk uh, last that long, though. How's she doing? She's doing good. That's why I wanted to get her on there. I wanted to get her a live session. Did you get anything, Phil? Hmm? Did you get uh, anything? Yeah, I, I took five years off the age. Right? Oh, oh, what, a, what a what a pal. <laughs> uh, yeah, uh, just the negativity, release it. Well, I'm yeah. pretty much an easy going guy. He has um, a question he wants to ask, but he wants to ask it after the recording's over, um, off. So, Phil, yeah. um, I don't yes. really know I'm picking up on it because you did it, but I was picking up on for Trey. Um, um, from your crystal aspect, like a blue diamond for a heart. That's the one. Get that in, Mum. I just didn't know if you'd done it or whether I need to tell you do it. Sorry. Yeah, that's it. Very nice. What, what am I supposed to do? I didn't get all that. Gillian? Um, To place a blue crystal diamond within a heart chakra. I'll ask uh, Everett, is the name. I'll ask yeah. Chris. I'm amazed that you need to get the colour in She's always laughing. Then, um, well, it feels. I say I can't see it feels. Very bright, white, you know, when blue is white, and then 
ready blue. I was actually repairing crystal grids and that's the first time I actually saw her. She said I was crap at it. That's, that's <laughs> the words. That's the actual words. She said I'll do it. <laughs> what? It feels very direct because she knows. Is, Trish, is that for Trish? Hmm? That was for Trish. Okay. Trish, Trish is an angelic being. Yeah. Perfect. I just, I, I just asked her to do it. She said she's already doing it. She is direct. Yeah. yeah and she, she's, very... she's picked up all my swear words, which is annoying. <laughs> <laughs> I was doing safe for high beam direct. That's because she's got my, uh, she's looked into my uh, brain. And I've picked up on why you're getting a bit irritated by Archangel Michael, because he's a bit direct with you as well. He's very direct, direct <laughs> with me too, but I love him. He, he saved me life and he'll remind me every time. What you know, she don't, what she don't. I said, <laughs> I've only done it the once. <laughs> So yeah, 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 definitely. Very direct. I saved your life once too, Moses. No one knows that one. Wow. I don't like the religion ones. <laughs> Uh, I found a, another aspect of the uh, blue avon, you know, the blue bird sort of. Yeah. 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 That, that's come along recently just to know. Right. Your blue avon. They, the... they used to appear. They used to appear here. Mm. Rick saw one here. What was Rick that? Rick saw no, one appear here. Sorry. No, no okay. I'll, I, I need to um, speak about that later. It's not for now. I almost said sorry. <laughs> Yeah, I, I do that a lot. Some of my yeah. healing stuff I've given, I've been told not to give it, and I give it anyway. So. Well, what I got about that was, is Deb's right, because obviously there's a law for everything, and there's a universal law, and it's there for a reason. Yeah. And then I got, you know, the last session, yeah. and then um, the message I got then was actually, though, if you're operating from 5D and above, everything then becomes not about duality, so you're both right. It depends where you are at the time, what you're operating from. So you, you actually think you shouldn't be doing it, but actually, if you're on the 5D frequency and above at the time, you can't. Right. I'll have to go 5D then. <laughs> I get that. Yeah. Right, Don, say stop. No. Uh, power it's not come out before tonight power 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 oh power okay. you have the power of the creator divine love wisdom intelligence is able you can use it to see the future mm -hmm. and angels you see angels I see you guys <laughs> <laughs> I'm not an angel he's married you're married to an angel so yes, yes you I do. do I do every day <laughs> <laughs> Rick and I are not the angelic realm we're not we're not but, angels <laughs> But remember that you got the power of the sword. It says there, the Venus said, Phil, you are the last one. Uh, have I got to pick my own card here? <laughs> well, you, yes. you still got Deb. No, he, he chose for us while, okay. while we were waiting for you to bring um, Trish. Okay. Yes, thank you, hon. Hug the bear. Uh, uh, I want something like blessing, please. He always tells me to hug the bear. <laughs> <laughs> you're the bear oh no bear. I'm going to leave this card out next time because I know it says listening does that set me that I don't listen enough <laughs> Uh, or does it mean that I'm listening to him now? Mm. <laughs> I've got to gain knowledge by listening. Um, Bill, yeah? <laughs> you'll find this funny. Is it you who's got the um, smoke alarm that the battery's running low? Yeah. Well, that message came in for you when you, your smoke alarm battery started going low was the mess that your battery was low. All oh, right, okay. Yeah, Yeah. I'd, I'd replace that. Oh, <laughs> my God. Because they are laughing just as much as I am. You, to, you mean that... Constant beeping that he never hears. Yeah. They are laughing because I've dead, like because I've said he. They were mm. like we tell him all the time, and he doesn't listen. Mm. <laughs> I, I like. I like. I like. I don't even. I don't even hear it. I'm going. I not hear that annoying sound. Yeah. <laughs> it's more annoying when I'm cooking. It's in the kitchen. It yeah, goes off for anything. That mm -hmm. noise right there. That one. I can't hear it. The one that's on every recording for the last year. <laughs> The people are like, who's who, who needs to change their battery and their smoke alarm? <laughs> I think it's only it, Phil. I think it's the spirit world just making that noise. No, it's your freaking smoke alarm. <laughs> I, I haven't got one, honestly. His actual battery was running low at the start. Now <laughs> you got the bird thinking it's another bird. <laughs> <laughs> I think he were cheating on them. <laughs> He's got women a lot. He still doesn't listen. And I was like, oh, maybe it's the beeping. <laughs> 
<laughs> I can't sit in that. I can't sit in that webinar with that annoying. <laughs> <laughs> Tell us when you had the next one because I can't. Uh, I'm not used to it. It's the worst webinar ever. All you hear is just. Yeah, you need done ideas. It's so unprofessional. <laughs> so he can heal people, but he can't change a battery. <laughs> Two years ago, that his battery is that physical battery was running low. How, how long ago? Two years? No, I don't know. I don't know. But apparently when that battery started beeping, it was like a double messy. It was like your battery was low as well. But you don't listen. I've, I've written. I've, my battery's gone quite well in the last few days, but the one in the kitchen. I've, <laughs> I've offered to mail him D battery. <laughs> yeah, but you can't. It's not his ears. <laughs> The alarm goes off just as well. I think it's uh, I think it's just an I don't think it's to say the batteries are low. I think it's to say the alarm's working. <laughs> it only does that when the batteries are dead. Uh, but it's been it goes off every time it cooks. So. Every about every two, three minutes. <laughs> until you change the battery. You can actually remove it and it'll still go off. I broke my ankle, I can't reach that. Now I've got the damn bird. <laughs> All right, we need to stop the recording. Well, I, want to thank, I want to thank everybody for joining us and for abusing Philip. What is that? Your car. Cosmic rainbow. Oh. Cosmic oh. rainbow? That's your car, Phil. What does that mean? Oh, let me see. Hold on. Can you see it? Cosmic rainbow. Does that mean I'm going to win on the lottery? It means you are going to ride a unicorn to change your battery. <laughs> <laughs> uh, ooh, I'm sure you made that up. <laughs> I've got to have a unicorn energy. <laughs> Thank you, everybody, for joining us. When we will see you next month for the sa same place, same time. Um, don't forget, for Nilesh's um, next meeting with us is on December 4th on Saturday. It's going to be a very exciting one. I will post the link for the Zoom, Zoom link uh, starting next week. You can stop the recording now.